Grand Blue Fantasy versus Rising is going free to play. But you already knew that probably. So what I want to talk to you guys about is how crazy this free to play is about to get. Let's get into it. So Zeta slow. So on Evo Sunday, we got a huge peek into what is coming next for Grand Blue Fantasy versus Rising. This includes the pricing, the release date, as well as some game modes and characters that will be in the game. But with this, we got to see a lot more of what the big mode Grand Brews Legends is going to be having. So as we said, Grand Blue versus Rising is going free to play. One of the main modes that is going to be playable in the free to play version of Grand Blue versus Rising is Grand Brews Legends. Contrary to what I've been saying before, Grand Brews Legends is a lot more than just the Fall Guys mode and the, the Gold Rush thing that you saw before. It's the entire open lobby system. The point of Grand Brews Legends is to become a big hub world MMO style part of the game that Grand Brew vs Rising is going to have. And in this you'll be able to customize your avatar, you'll be able to go around the world, you'll be able to play mini games with other people, as well as get into fights with people to play the regular fighting game part of the game. We've also seen a few of the locales that this mode has to offer. I believe at the very beginning of the first trailer we ever saw for this game is the starting area and then you kind of have an open area below that that they showed that has like the little cafe and all those different things. Uh, they showed the arcade area which is kind of like something that you find very standard in Arxis games or at least older ones. And we have a new place and this place is very important. The Shibuya area. And this area to me screams collab. <laughs> Especially if you've been keeping up with what's happening in Grand Blue Fantasy, the mobile game right now, you'll understand. Grand Blue does not play about its collabs, and they've even like talked about it a little bit more on Twitter, but that'll be in another video. Now, as for modes in Grand Blue's Legends, there's going to be a lot more than we initially thought. So initially I thought that there was just gonna be the Fall Guys mode, the gold digging mode, and then the soccer mode. It looks like they're gonna branch out to a lot of other things. I even saw that there was a mode where you guys are working together in a PvE setting to fight off a horde of enemies. So I'm wondering, is there gonna be raids and things like that? This game literally supports up to 30 people and they show that on the website. For Grand Brews Legends being the central focus of the free to play version of Grand Brew versus Rising, I think it's showing a lot of promise and I think this is gonna be a mode that gets a lot of people into the game. So what do you guys think? Do you think this is going to garner another long-term audience for Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising outside of the main fighting game people that play fighting games always? Also, do you guys plan on getting the free play version? Please let me know down in the comments below. We are almost at 5k. I want to thank each and every one of you guys. We are very, very close. Please hit the like button on this video and definitely hit that subscribe if you're new here. This has been your boy, Young Zeta Slow. Until next time, everybody, stay healthy, stay happy, and stay groovy. Please stay healthy. Your boy was sick. Bro, stay healthy. But anyway, we out of here. Peace, y'all. Y'all be great.